Proverbs chapter 4, verses 18 and 19. But the path of the just is like the shining sun that shines ever brighter unto the perfect day. The way of the wicked is like darkness. They do not know what makes them stumble. Now, the first meaning that comes to us is that of a morning sun that rises higher in the sky until noonday and produces the perfect day. The morning sun can be very beautiful. It's often golden or red, and the first spear of gold over the sea horizon is an exciting event. Every lost sinner who is born again through faith in Jesus is a spear of golden light breaking the dark horizon and forming a sparkling path across the sea. Every new birth is an exciting miracle. Now we are told that the colours are due to the sun shining through much more of the atmosphere due to its acute angle. As it rises, it passes through less and less thicknesses of atmosphere, and so the midday sun is usually brilliant white. When first we're born again, the light needs to shine through a great deal of our own old natures, our own atmosphere, so to speak, and the light is discoloured and weak compared with what it will later become. But we mustn't devalue this light. It's shining through a character that may need a lot of work, but is a character precious to God and loved by him. He knows the true essence of every one of his children, their uniqueness. Who knows how much of our original natures will be restored to us when we see him face to face. A colour, if you like, unique to us. And it's interesting that as the sun dips down at the end of the day, the colours return. Maybe God is telling us something. But the high sun of the day is what really gives warmth, light and life to everything. The high sun bestows benediction on everything in sight, encouraging the hidden seeds to break through the dormant earth, nourishing the leaves of the trees, warming every creature, shedding light into every darkened room. The high sun is generous. And so, as a Christian matures, he or she becomes a blessing wherever they go. They have generous natures because freely have they received and freely they can give. Matthew 10, 8. Because they have an endless supply. Jesus said, I came that they might have life and life in all its fullness. John 10, 10. The sun shines ever brighter unto the perfect day.